So, there's a competition being held by Park Dean Resorts, calling for Minecrafters to design the next big thing for them to put in their parks. Park Dean's YouTube video advertising the competition was released on the 23rd of April, and the competition closes tomorrow on the 23rd of May. There is a cash prize of £500 for the winner, and for that reason, among others, I decided that I would throw my hat in the ring. Welcome to the video. My name is Argent Sergeant, and this is my entry to Park Dean's competition. As a general overview, this place is a combination of a water park and an outdoor music venue slash show bar. I love karaoke and I love flumes, so this to me is a match made in heaven. Let's start from where we walk in, and I'll talk about the guest experience first before I describe the ancillary supporting features. You will notice that this place is very well served, with food and drinks kiosks, a concierge stand, and the all-important shiny new showers and toilets around the back. When you come here during the day, you will find this resin-bonded gravel area loaded up with chairs and tables. Parents can relax in the sun and enjoy a cold beverage on the outdoor furniture under the parasol, or sat on the concrete bleacher seating decorated in the Park Dean Resort's colours, while kids of all ages from 8 to 38 can come out and splash around in the pool and ride one of our four immense log flumes. Over here in green, we have the Quaver, because it looks a bit like a musical note. In this reddish pinkish colour, don't ask me, I'm colourblind, we have Typhoon. This yellow one is called Bulldozer, and in this wonderful deep purple kind of colour, we have my personal favourite, which is called Super Soup. You can get to your preferred log flume by climbing the staircase around one of these towers. It might take you a little while to get up here, but it won't take you very long to get back down again. Alright, it's a little bit clunky at the moment, but you catch my drift. These two towers in the middle, with the huge truss between them, are our control towers that serve the pool during the day and manage the stage shows at night. From up here, our crew can monitor the safety of the guests, as well as control the lighting, wave machine and water fountains here in the pool. On top of this structure is a massive rolled up canopy that can be deployed by our crew depending on weather conditions. These iron bars represent the steel cables that the canopy is tied to. This will protect our performers and our guests from unexpected weather conditions and mean that we don't have to let a little rain spoil our fun. When the lights go down at night, the place takes on an entirely different personality. As our performers take the stage and bring the nightlife to you, the lighting and water features add a whole new dimension to our performances. If you've ever seen Fantasmic at Disney's Hollywood Studios, I'm imagining a little slice of that. There are a few staff-only areas here, such as this storage area here under the bleachers, which will take all of our external furniture should we need to clear the decks. But most of our staff areas are on the other side over by the stage. Authorised personnel can get inside these towers to access the high level control areas and down at ground level we can enter this shack down here to the side, which is a general store for the day to day running of the pool. Down the stairs here though, we have staff toilets to the right, and to the left we have a staff room and canteen, with a kitchenette, an assortment of seating and the all important lockers and coat hooks. We have a very loud plant room to run our pumps and the wave machine. Another second, quieter plant room. And a store for all of our musical equipment. I haven't installed the lift just yet, but this is the lift shaft, and it comes out here behind the stage to keep things simple for our staff before showtime. So those are my proposals for the ins and outs of the next big thing coming to a holiday resort near you, if you're in the UK at least. Really hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please press the like button, and if you want to see more of my content, please do subscribe. I've been Argent Sergeant, and you've been fantastic. Thanks, and have a wonderful summer holiday, whether you find yourself at a Park Dean Resort or not. See you later. Also, I'm not sponsored by Park Dean Resorts. Just thought you ought to know that. See ya.